Mother's Day to all those awesome moms out there who brought us into this world. Feel free to do a video response or simply tell us. It gives us ideas for next year. I'll let you know what I did for my mom this year. I didn't know what to get her, so went to Godiva Chocolates, got her some chocolates. Expensive but good Belgian chocolates. Very, very good. Suggestion. My dad loved it. My mom loved it. Everybody loved it. So, there's my response. Can I see yours? We went to go eat. My mom had the day off. And she had gone to the movies with my two sisters. For Mother's Day, Sandra came down all the way from Hawaii to visit her mom and family, to spend time with them, give her mom a necklace, and her Mother's Day was excellent. Sandra's back! And I'm just going to be waving a lot today. <laughs> Happy and she's not drunk. Hey, I totally am. No, I'm not. <laughs> I haven't had any alcohol. <laughs> and that's your Sandra. It's 5 o'clock in the morning, went to work, worked all day, got home, got my stuff, went to the airport, flight left at 9.15, flew until 7.20 to Salt Lake, which granted it's a four hour time change, so it was literally like 3.20. Then transferred to another flight, got down to Phoenix by 9.15, which was really like 3.15. No, sorry, 6.15. 6.15 Hawaii time. Then I stayed up all day visiting with everybody and everybody and everybody. And uh, I think I got maybe two hours sleep on the plane. But yeah, and then I stayed up until midnight. Then I went to bed and woke up at 8 this morning. Why are we filming when I'm eating? I don't think he was doing it on purpose. He just happened to be filming every time we were eating. <laughs> Popping in Starburst. Eating at Texas Roadhouse. Now I'm getting filmed eating. Right? I just wanted to take the time to thank all who've made suggestions or comments. The suggestion that was put there, I took into consideration, took it upon myself to try. So you've got a first attempt at a voiceover. It is sure to be comical at least, if not just purely to make a fool of myself. So watch, learn, comment. If you wish to make a video response, I'd love it. I want to see it. Go for it. I dare you. I double dare you. It was a dark and shady night. The precious was lounging around the house. But then Fess came and she sensed him all around. But she became agitated. Fess looked too content. He was definitely up to something. And then the food bowl's empty. I wonder who did it. She was mortified. Fess, you ate all the food? Before bed, Princess realized she'd overlooked something rather important. Oh, Lord. Dear Lord. Please make the camera go away. Please, please. It rather scares me. How many times have you made the attempt to pass it on to somebody else? Something good unexpected that you just totally don't expect. Well, chance meeting in the parking lot, had me meet this one lady. She had her little girl with her, and she was asking for money. I never have cash with me because cash never lasts long with me. But 
I offered to get her some food and she said sure. Total at the register after discount and everything was $9.99. So this was my chance to pass it on. It made her happy, her mom happy, and her two kids happy. They had food for another day. So next time, when you see somebody you need, don't be afraid to help them out. They're asking for money. If you don't want to give them money and you don't feel comfortable with it, get them something to eat. Just pass it on and you never know what good's going to happen. I'm going to tell you about something that they'll do in the retail parking lot. Now these are customers who are selling perfume. And it'll be in their trunk. Be very, very weary of it. For the reason that, that perfume will make you pass out. While you're passed out, they'll get your keys, rob your car, and or you. Lord knows what else they'll do. So just be very, very weary of them. And just say no thanks. Not saying that not all of the people are doing that, but the ones that are, are ruining it for everyone. So just keep an eye out. Be safe.